So basically you told me that you already shared a lot of spam keys to the people, to the other clients. So now it's risky that you want to move it to the password protection of instance and want to dis, uh, disable the PEM key. So no user can able to connect to the instance with PEM key. So I'm going to show you how you can disable PEM key. So before we activate password, you first have to connect to the instance. You told me to, you, I can do anything, uh, not anything like make configuration in this instance. So let's make configuration. Of course, it will not disturb your uh, running website or anything. You just go click on connect and copy this one okay you must have a pem key this must you have it okay so i'm gonna show you i have this in my downloads folder so i'm gonna connect now so let's open cmd and i'm gonna copy this one and paste this one so oh, of course it's not gonna work because here user is admin so majority time the user will be bitnami because of the operating system you install okay now we are inside the instant so let's disable the PEM configuration as you see when I log into the PEM key it will not ask me about password or anything just with the key I am in the root right now so let's go type this command I will give this command in the description also so you will be logged uh, up into this window so before you have to move it to you first have to uncomment Permit root login, scroll down and you will see this pub key authentication. This is basically that allowing a user or client to connect to the instance using public key, the key, you know, the key which we use, this one, this one. So it just means, yes, a user can use key to connect, but no means if you have this key, you will not able to connect any key. The public authentication key will disable now. Now scroll down and the password authentication is like yes. A user can uh, join with the password and the public key authentication is off. Now let's escape and type semicolon wq and this is for save. Asymmetry. You can also use nano to edit this file. Now you have to type service ssd restart. This is gonna restart SSD and now set the password of root. I can tell you how you can do sudo and type new password. I'm gonna type it as the rate Okay, so this is the password. Let me try a different password like uh, this. I think I get Ubuntu 13 is enough. I activated the password less test let's open the CMD for before closing this instance first test is that either root is logging or not if you close this and you the password is not configured properly then you are gone like uh, then they will no possible to connect to the instance so better have a snapshot I already take the snapshot of this instance Great. and the IP is you can get IP Now it's gonna ask password. I'm gonna ask password. Type the password. You see, I'm connected to the root. Now it says, Now let's go from exit. exit. Now let's try to connect to the same instance using uh, spam key. So this is the command I typed before, but now it will ask me the password of Bitnami. I don't have Bitnami password. You can uh, configure Bitnami password also like this. But right now, instead of connecting to like, connect like this root activate this one or you can ip use it both are the same this ip or the main ip you can use type ubuntu one you see and see you are oh wait if you are connected properly before i type the password wrong. so this is the concept how to you can connect to the password uh, if you need information before I must tell you when you are going to make configuration you must make snapshot you can go instance before performing any configuration go to instance go to uh, where is volume storage 
click on volume id and click on volume id and you can also click like when you come here to the screen click here and choose create snapshot as i already create snapshot i can show you from here see this is the snapshot i made to perform any configuration before this is the snapshot of volume i already made so see by easy to right now i made so if any configuration go wrong i can revert changes back easily so this is i think this is it for how to change